hello everyone in this video i just wanted to bring your attention to one of the major security advisory that got released from microsoft today uh, this is march 2nd 2021 it got released couple hours back and see this is marked to uh, 602 is when i'm recording this video uh, this in this one they are suggesting it's out of band really released by the way so it's a very serious and critical vulnerability that they're considering and related to exchange servers that you have there are four different vulnerabilities that are being exploited by a particular group named hafnium who typically targets organizations like uh, in the disease researchers infectious disease researchers firms law firms higher education defense contractors and ngos so uh, the technical detail you have four vulnerabilities listed in here the on uh, the good thing all of them are uh, are part of the microsoft exchange if you look at the first one this is the server side request forgery vulnerability in exchange that allowed the attacker to send arbitrary http request and authenticate as exchange server the second one is related to insecure deserialization of the vulnerability the third one is a post authentication arbitrary file vulnerability and the last one is similar a post authentication arbitrary file write vulnerability but if you look at any of them okay i have just opened up a couple of them here and you if you look at it look at the attack vector and the cvs score uh, the, the most important thing the vulnerability all of them is really part of an attack chain the initial attack requires the ability to make an untrusted connection to exchange server port 443 so if your server is really exposed to, to the public then you are you are in trouble so this can be protected against by restricting untrusted connections or by setting up a vpn to separate the exchange server from external access so if you have your server that you're using and it's completely internal you at least have some uh, mitigation to these particular servers okay but read this using this mitigation will only protect against the initial portion of the attack the other portion of the chain can be triggered if the attacker already have an access or can convince an administrator to open a malicious file so microsoft is treating this particular vulnerability as very high they don't release out of band security patches very often but they have released it for for these particular vulnerabilities and they have a very good details about the how the attack is being performed so i would recommend that you read this particular article uh, using proc dump uh, to the last last process memory uh, uh, then then going through a whole bunch of commands and uh, they are also giving you checks whether how to how to figure out whether you are already compromised for this vulnerability and uh, uh, they have a whole bunch of information about how to kind of look at this vulnerability from different uh, antivirus solutions and uh, what i wanted to show you the another link so there were uh, another article over here defending exchange server under attack that was released actually early like last year so i would recommend that you should read up this art article as well uh, kind of talked about similar type vulnerability and how it it can be exploited and, and 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 controlled and the last thing i wanted to say if you also do some google search you will you will figure out uh, what is everybody is going and talking a lot about this vulnerability and uh, we got already uh, the patches available for this particular server so uh, so just go for it and download uh, your patches and uh, make sure that at least you are behind uh, in a, even your servers are not exposed to the public and uh, here is that uh, microsoft team and i'm going to give you this link to this uh, uh, to, to to this page as well so you can quickly get to this page and uh, so take a look at how your exchange server is configured at the moment uh, take the actions that you sh you need to take and be safe thanks for watching